the committee made the right decision in selecting a downtown location for a new train station. I think this, is, this was a generational opportunity lost. I think this is a suboptimal uh, outcome, but it's the outcome that we have. After months and months and months of debate, a decision has finally been made. A new train station could be built in downtown Buffalo. Several options were on the table, and people pushing for the central terminal say they're against this decision. The new station could be built near the existing station on Exchange Street. News 4's Dave Graber was at today's decision meeting. He has more reaction tonight. Dave? Well, Jackie, Don, today's meeting marks the end of a six-month challenge by Governor Andrew Cuomo for the selection committee to decide where the state should build a new train station. And although not everyone agreed, including those on the committee, the group did its job. Buffalo's new train station will be built downtown. Please say aye. Uh, Central Terminal is a small-scale museum of local rail, the kickoff site of this week's Dingus Day Parade, even the backdrop for a major motion picture. But it will not be the city's new train station. Those opposed? By a vote of 10 to 4 with one abstention, the committee recommends building a new train station downtown. Whether passengers will get off at Canal Side, near the existing Exchange Street location, or another site altogether, that'll be up to the state DOT. The biggest advantage to a downtown station, its proximity to hotels and restaurants and other modes of transportation. I think we need to do what's right for the few people who will ride the train. That when they get off, if they want to get to our rapid rail, which is not that rapid, if they want to get to that, it's there. If they want to get on a bus, it's there. If they want to get to a hotel, it's there. The decision was made despite what Congressman Brian Higgins said was overwhelming support from the public. More than 80% of those surveyed in favor of Central Terminal. I think this, is, this was a generational opportunity lost. I think this is a suboptimal uh, outcome, but it's the outcome that we have. The recommendation will now be passed on to Albany, which will lead the project that could take another five to seven years to complete. I think they are going to be very focused on moving this process forward very aggressively, uh, as quickly as possible, to make sure that the new train station is built out as quickly as possible. Well, those who voted against the downtown selection said at the very least this process has drawn more attention to some kind of reuse of the central terminal. That means investment. And Assemblywoman Crystal People Stokes said today that she announced $250,000 from the state will be used for electrical upgrades at the historic site on the city's east side. Reporting live in the studio, Dave Graber, News 4 at 6.